for the last year and a half, East San Jose has been struggling, not just economically, but physically, with a lot of us being impacted by COVID-19. This used to be my omelet house. This is where I would have breakfast every morning. I know this family. They, this is an example of a business that should still be here today, that the city should have done everything possible to have supported early on. And instead, they're not here anymore. And we've lost a lot of places like this place behind me because the city was negligent in its attack of this issue in terms of how to support East San Jose. So what I'm proposing is the city of San Jose purchase these vacant buildings or lease them and actually open them up and give these spaces to small businesses that are doing everything they can to hold on. It has taken far too long for East San Jose's representation to finally wake up and realize what we need. I made it a point when I got out of the hospital to immediately hit the ground running, uh, even, even, even with oxygen masks on, to raise funds and put money directly into people's pockets. And why? Because it wasn't happening and someone had to step up to do that. No fake press conferences highlighting a rescue plan. We're still not rescued because what we need today is capital. What we need today is for that money to be injected into our businesses to make our neighborhoods work. Why I'm calling for the city to purchase these buildings is quite simple because even with the economy reopening, it's not gonna be as simple as reopening. The businesses that were here before COVID aren't here anymore. No amount of lip service is going to change the fact that we were ignored for a year and a half. No amount of lip service is going to change the fact that in January, February, March, April, May, June, I was out there with the community. We were raising funds to keep these businesses open and City Hall left us to fend for ourselves. So today what I'm asking for is the city to purchase these buildings, to give our community the cash injection, the boost that we need to get out of this crisis better off than how we started it.